We were trying to set up Kubernetes with Docker and getting stuck. Since uh, Kubernetes version v.1.24, Docker doesn't support work out of box anymore. But there is a fix and it takes less than two minutes. Kubernetes no longer support Docker directly as a container runtime interface. Now only support runtime that speaks the CRI, the container runtime and Docker doesn't. That's why our setup is failed. So here is a mock question that describes the same situation that uh, install the dev package CRI docker D uh, version is uh, Ubuntu Fogel and this is MD and enable start these services so uh, we must require to enable CRI docker D uh, CRI docker services CRI docker dot docker services and CRI start CRI docker services so, so uh, this is not available in my blank environment uh, so I need to get this file so copy this link and paste it here surely I will provide the link of this file so ls hyphen l so you will find this file is here so sometime thing is that that uh, you want that sudo permission and uh, root user permission so you can do like that or otherwise sometime it won't needed so sudo app to install hyphen y dot slash cri or else dpkg is also used to install this uh, files so so i can use sudo dpkg hyphen i and that file name so better to use dpkg uh, if any dependency or uh, any error you first uh, install the dependent means install that uh, sudo get update install and then and there first systemctl daemon re e x e c this command is not much required but uh, this command tells systemd to re-execute itself means uh, it reloads its own binary into a memory when new systemd services are installed like uh, cri docker services and socket from the dev file systemd may not pick them until it reinitialize you can think like it's refreshing systemd itself and second command which need it's if this is not you need to place sudo also so i just place sudo also okay so sudo system ctl enable cri docker services remember this command and uh, 10 times 20 times so that you won't forget okay set the cri docker services to start automatically at the system board why it is used ensure that docker d is available every time when system restart it create a system link in particular folders anytime you want a service to persist across reboots and same command just uh, now and services okay so what it do enables the docker d socket on the boot and start immediately at the same step cri docker dot socket is uh, socket activated services when kubernetes contacts the cri socket at particular folder systemd starts and cri docker d if it isn't already running this is always for socket activated services that you want running now and after the reboot on the reboot and the least but and last one is that uh, sudo system ctl start cri docker dot services service this is manually start the actual cri docker dot services right now although the sockets can start automatically when accessed it's a good practice to start it directly so that you can check its log status and debug early in exam it is advisable whatever you remember you do it because uh, sometime uh, if it is a step marking you will get uh, some marks it's just a uh, tips of the ck exams so now run sudo systems ctl status cri hyphen sorry uh, one wrong thing so you'll find this now same thing you can do for socket also great now you can check uh, whether that uh, socket file exists so here it is existing sorry exists this shows that system is ready for uh, this in it so here i'm wrapping up and uh, if you want to get uh, any query uh, means if you want to get in touch with me or if you want to have any queries i'm happy to resolve it uh, so you can connect with me at the rate neo cloud dot cloud 
at the rate uh, gmail.com and uh, not found but uh, it is available so i'm preparing a lot of uh, stuff which means i'm uh, targeting on the topic which is not available mainly selectively on the internet uh, so many people can find it useful not have the repeated one yes repeated topic like the concept will always be there but uh, here out of the box topic is also available which you won't find anywhere on internet before the video uploads thank you so much for your love and support stay tuned stay connected and 